for this year. The focus is on the forthcoming off-cycle governorship elections in Edo and Ondo state. And the electoral umpire is not mincing words regarding its determination to ensuring that the elections are credible. Unethical and corrupt practices by election officials will not be tolerated and shall impose severe punishments under the law. However, the Director General of the Electoral Institute is emphasizing the importance of training for personnel to enhance electoral integrity. It is our responsibility as an EMB to ensure that the electoral process is conducted with utmost professionalism and integrity. And this can only be achieved through rigorous training and continuous capacity building of election personnel. Although there is a consensus on the importance of training for election officials, some of the participants believe that the electoral umpire also needs to keep an eye on the recruitment process of personnel. What is the character of the individuals who are being recruited to serve as ad hoc officials or manage our elections? And so INEC needs to institute mechanisms that checks the character of those individuals. Because you can give training to anybody and they will have the competence, but if they don't have the character, they will yield to politicians and falsify results or prefer result sheets that we saw in places like Kogi and, um, and, and Imo. So it's not necessarily about training, it's about the character of the people. Uh, in conjunction with INEC and we support with INEC, thanks to INEC, because what INEC does for us most time is see how to train the, uh, the polling unit agents. We do that a lot. But just like I said, the, the influence of money and other variables in our election, you see most of uh, the, the polling unit agents, they got bought over at the, at the polling unit and they don't do what they're supposed to do for their parties. INEC will be conducting off-cycle governorship elections in Edo and Ondo states in September and November this year, a time many hope that the Commission will bring the lessons learned from the 2023 general elections and all previous off-cycle elections to bear.